People in Amesbury are in mourning, grieving the death of a teenager killed in a weekend snowmobile accident. There have been nearly a dozen snowmobile accidents in New England over the last few days. Tiffany Chan has more on the tragedy that is affecting so many in Amesbury. We're hearing from those who knew Troy Martin. They called him an easygoing guy who loved the simple things in life, fishing and being around a campfire. His friends tell us he'll be missed by not only the football team, but by the entire community. It's been a heart-wrenching time for the friends and family of 17-year-old Troy Martin. Troy was like, just like the best friend that you could ask for. The Amesbury High School senior was killed while snowmobiling with fellow classmates in Maine over the weekend. Martin failed to negotiate a turn, hit a snowbank, and was thrown from the vehicle. His best friend, Quinn Lysick, says he was known for being a star on the football field. But Martin's true passion... Hunting and fishing. That, that was really what he loved doing. Over the weekend, there were 10 snowmobile accidents across Maine and New Hampshire. A 54-year-old Attleboro woman struck a tree while snowmobiling in the White Mountains Saturday. Her husband tells us she's lucky to be alive. You just have to be cautious. And Luckily, she had a helmet on and she had the right gear on. and. Um, that saved our life, probably. New Hampshire Fish and Game echoing that same message, telling us help isn't as close as you might think. We can't give like any like hospital care, and and that could be two hours away. I mean, depending on where you're located in the state. And that GoFundMe page has raised more than $7,000 within the first three hours. If you'd like to help that family with funeral expenses, you can find that link on CBSBoston.com. In Amesbury, I'm Tiffany Chan for WBZ News. We have developing.